channel and today I have another Shein haul for you guys. Um, just a little disclaimer, I am still dealing with my breast infection. So you will see the band-aids or like the bumps and stuff going on in, throughout the video. So just in case you guys see, notice anything different, um, that's what's going on. If you're interested in knowing more about that, um, there's a video that I did a few weeks back. So you guys can catch up on what's going on. But um, I'll be giving, a, what's it called, an update soon. So trust me, it got a lot worse. So anyways, um, let's just get back to the video and I hope you guys enjoy it. So the first item I got was this dress that just made me think of Thanksgiving. So excuse the little bump, you could probably see it. I, well, at least I saw it in the light or whatever. But yeah, I really like this dress for Thanksgiving. I know I'm thinking like way ahead, but um, there was two similar dresses and I just went for this one. The material on this dress is a little, it's more fresh and it's like that stretchy, silky material. I don't know how to explain it. It's very comfortable and it has pockets, which they're pretty big and I like them. I can store my phone in there or whatever. So I always love dresses with pockets. So I thought it was a really cute fall dress. The next dress is actually more ruffly and it has ruffles on the top neckline and it has ruffles towards the bottom. Um, it looks exactly the, like the picture and it stretches uh, quite a bit on the sleeves but it's kind of tight on my breast area. I don't know if it's just because I have my breast swollen but it's pretty comfortable. It has a zipper on the side. It was kind of difficult when I took it off. I actually like snapped it a little bit just because... I needed help taking it off from like so I wouldn't stretch it and crack it or whatever. But yeah, it's pretty comfortable and for my boob size, I mean, if you have a larger chest, I would probably size up because it is a little tight, but it might just be my breast. So this next dress I thought was really cute. It kind of reminded me of a vintage like sofa or like chair type of thing. I thought you can like tighten it up because it is a little loose on top but it just turns out to just be like cloth so that was kind of pointless but it is a little loose it has a peekaboo section and um, everything else fit great it's very thin um, but I didn't mind it's really fresh it's not really see-through so that's always good too um, I'll just I don't know I guess I'll have to go for a baggy look on the top or whatever but I liked it it was really cute and vintage style so I, it's flowy too so yeah I liked it this next dress um, looked prettier in picture it's a very thick material so it's not really even good for summer because I think I would sweat a lot I thought it was actually like the buttons work but they don't it's kind of like just for decor, and it kind of has a weird gap in between so I would probably have to pin it down with something so I would keep it from like opening because anything it just kind of like looks like that so that's not very cute I thought it was going to be more of a thin, like fresh um, material, but it's not. It's like very thick and heavy. So, but the print's pretty. I like the collar. It's very like boxy and different. Um, the sleeves are long enough too. Um, they do button. I didn't button them for the sake of the video, but they're very tight at the wrist. So unless you have um, thicker wrist i don't know if it would feel comfortable for me it barely did this next bodysuit i ordered um i ordered it in black and white i wasn't sure about the sizing um it looked really like exposing but it does cover most of my butt so i don't mind it and i will probably obviously wear it without a underwear but i do notice that it bothers me a little bit underneath the button so i don't know how comfortable that actually would be it wasn't that hard to reach out and like button them on this one now i paired these with um these pants the picture looked a little darker shade of gray but um i don't mind the color anyways it's still fine um the material is that um like spandex type of material it's not cotton at all so I feel like I would sweat a lot in these. I don't know. Maybe during the winter I would wear them more. I like them. They didn't make me look too um, pregnant. I don't like how I have that pregnancy pooch or whatever. But I like them. They're very comfortable except for the material. I wish they were cotton. But um, I still like them. So that's fine. They were playing with the stripes on the side. So I bought this one in white as well. But I ordered it in two extra large. So I went a size up even more. 
So I really liked that one better because it was easier to button than the black one. The black one was kind of hard to reach because the buttons are more towards the back instead of towards the front. If that makes sense. So I had to really bend to like stretch it out and button it. So I didn't like it. So if I'm going to order these again. But I'll probably order this time 2XL. Because it was a lot easier to like button. The last item that I have is this um, blouse dress. It's really long and flowy. I really liked it. And it fits exactly like the model. So I really appreciated um, this style. I did order this one a size down. So I ordered a zero extra large. And it fit perfectly. It was flowy. The sleeves fit well. I felt like I can move in it. So I really liked it. It is see-through. I would probably just wear it with like a black tank top underneath. Or like um, a bralette or something cute. So that was it you guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And be on the lookout for part 2. Which is um, just swimsuits. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.